hey guys this is Manchu and as I already told you today I will be doing a video on how to solve the media server issue that's like heating up and eating up all your battery in your Eureka so without any ado let's start what we need to do is you need to download this application called terminal emulator it's free on Google Play Store and like you can basically you can basically uh, use the terminal window in your cell phone without uh, any requirements of PC or a desktop at all so the basic requirements for this is you need to be rooted and if uh, you see media server running here instead of screen you see media server my media server is at 8% because I have already solved this issue using this method if you see media server eating up all of your battery up to 33-50% more than that then this is definitely gonna be of help to you what you need to do is you need to go to terminal emulator you need to be rooted and you just need to type in SU SU stands for super user you press enter you get a hash shine there you see it that stands for the super user privileges that you have already been granted now now you to know that which is that process that is means using up most of the processing time of your CPU and we specifically know that it's media server so what we're gonna do is like we're gonna use the top command by using the top command you get to know which are those processes that are using your CPU the most so top G R E P space media oops media yeah you got to press enter it will show you a list of all the processes that are currently running with the name media to stop this you need to press volume up volume down and C there you go uh, the updation has stopped and you, as you can see we got a media currently all these processes are using 0% of my CPU because my problem has already been fixed you get that my customer my problem hasn't fixed I don't see any CPU usage in the tech first or second or third anything like that if media server is like eating up all your battery it's showing it's using up 50 to 60 percent of your CPU usage it will be shown here all right you get to remember that it will be shown here here now once you get to know which is that process you will see media underscore RW this process this is the process that you need to get a list of files that this process has stuck that this process has stuck on uh, so for that we're gonna type in um, list of L S O F space G R E P space M E D I A underscore R W and then we got press enter. It will show you the names of the processes which like this sir this process scan or like got stuck on if if you're facing a problem you're definitely gonna see the name of the file which your server has stopped or stuck on so once you get to know this well like it is in uh, I got this file in data media zero that's the this part of my internal card and well, where is it I've got this folder path in my external SD card where I've kept this file and this shows that the media server is stuck on this file it is currently processing this file because it's there in my like it is playing so it is there in my RAM it is processing on it so it's showing here if you got any corrupt files in your media card or a file that is like huge in size then you're gonna see it here so once you get to know which file it is all you got to do is go to this root folder and all you need to do is place dot no media file you can also delete that file but if like that file is so important to you you might prefer placing a dot no media file in there so it would stop the media it will tell the media server that there is no media file placed in that folder and all you need to do is place that dot no media file it's a blank text file named dot n o m e d i a and that's it next time you reboot your media server won't be eating up all your process it, will, it is just gonna skip that file that's there and that's your, your problem will be solved i'm pretty sure about it thanks for watching